Hey, what's going on? Blair at the Car Guys here with Not From The UK, Simon He. How you doing? Doing good. How are you? All right. So this was the Car Guys Minerva Tournament. What did you end up placing? Uh, I got, I think, third or third or fourth. All right. One of those. It doesn't matter. Uh, so what, what did you end up playing? Uh, I played Magic Specter Odd Eyes. Uh, why did you choose this instead of like Monarchs or Cosmos or BA? Uh, because I felt like Monarchs break too much and I never liked BA because you can't get over big, big beaters. And then... Uh, Pendulums are just strong in general if you can get your plays off. Alright, let's get right into it. Let's see what you play. Alright, we got three of the dumbest cards in the game Magic Spectre, Bamuku. And then we got his fellow brother, Unicorns. And then we also played the three Fox to search out traps. And then uh, also three Toad to search out traps. This is the Magic Spectre engine. Then we played uh, three Eccentric. Uh, this card, this card was insane today. Um, the fact that you can pendulum summon the Kirin and then pop a spell and trap, great. Then we have three masters. This was probably honestly the MVP of the deck because it allowed me to go into Dynaster and then setting up Dynaster plus you know uh, Magic Spectre and, and some traps. You just can't kill them. And then for the uh, Odd Eyes engine, we played the two unicorns because of the high scale. Uh, play a one monkey board, a one phoenix. We played one sorcerer because we don't we didn't need more. We just wanted a level four, the Joker, the Odd Eyes Pendulum Dragon, and then we have the, the Lone Luster. And then uh, unexpected dies. This is to get your uh, master out so that you can normal summon your magic specter, add, add your trap, make a dinoster, and then pendulum summon back out. And then uh, we're playing three terraforming because this card is super important, especially coupled with this, which gives you advantage um, with magic specters, the odd eye, sky races, and then this card was a blowout all day long. Every time I play this, uh, except for the last round, I pretty much won. And then uh, for the Magic Spectre Traps, we played the two Tempest, two Tornado, and we had one Solid. Nice, nice. That was the main deck. Uh, we'll do Extra Deck next. To be honest, uh, like 50% of this was like useless. Uh, one one Totem Bird never went into it. Uh, one Break Sword went into it once, only because someone quaking me and I just had a clear space. Uh, Utopian Beyond never went into it, but it's a really good card. Diamond Dire never went into it. Chidori, I went into this a lot actually. This card uh, stacked the Garnet like three times. <laughs> uh, went into this once. It was okay. Um, I didn't make this at all. Uh, didn't make this at all either. Uh, we made the Utopia package like twice just to get game because it was, I had an odd eyes and then double damage and then even more damage. Then we're playing the most important card in the extra deck, three Dinoster. Uh, some people say two, but you honestly need three in this version because uh, your turn one plays basically make this and then afterwards you can just spam these out to make a, a Harbinger. And then we also have the Williams. And then for our side deck, uh, sided one of each of the match specters for different matchups like BA, Pendulums, uh, three drowning. Uh, this card was mainly for Pendulums. Uh, I didn't play any Cosmos at all today or BA, so I can't really say how well these would go against them. But. Uh, I never actually resolved this card once, but in theory it's good. Uh, two Chaos Trap Pull for Cosmos, VA, and Monarchs. Just good. Good card. Uh, three MSC, so we don't lose to Strike or Domain, but we still lost the Domain, so. <laughs> uh, one more Geki to, for Cosmos, Abyss Dweller, Regeki, but never never play Cosmos. BA, you know, Abyss Dweller, Regeki, never play BA. And then never drew this against Domain Monarchs, so we lost. Uh, two Gamma Seals for Cosmo matchup, because your Cosmo matchup is awful. If they get like a Dark Destroyer or any ship you can't target, you just, you just lose. And then uh, we played two Danko for the uh, random Demise decks. Uh, we played 
one. Played one, but like this wasn't really necessary to win. That was it. All right. Any shout outs you want to give? Uh, shout out to my boy Donish taking me up here. Yeah. And then uh, shout out to my locals, Corner. That's it. Oh, Simon, congratulations. What you gonna do with your um, with your prize stuff? Uh, I don't know. Probably just gonna open the box, see what I get. Maybe some more drownings. Cause I I got a place at a drowning. <laughs> nice, nice, yep. nice. All right. Well, congratulations to you. We'll see you next time. Thank you. Blair the car guy signing out.